receive the glory this morning. Deal with us. Change us. Transform us. Make us better than we can. In Jesus' precious name we worship. Hallelujah, someone. How are you doing, top service worshippers? How are you doing? We are divinely exempted, exempted from all evil. Amen. From poverty. Amen. From lack, from sickness. Amen. From any kind of infectious virus, disease, whatever it is. I'm divinely exempted. Help me smile at someone. On your right, no distance. Say, I'm here. Amen. Amen. There are some people that don't live in obedience. Let me give you one more chance to do it. Smile at someone and say, I'm here. I'm here. Hallelujah. By the grace of God, God has kept us. You all are shining, doing well. God is providing for you. You've not cried to the extent you couldn't sleep. And the time still comes, <laughs> the tears go. Has God not been faithful? Yeah. Can I get a witness by shouting a big hallelujah? God has been helping us and will be helping us as many as possible to make sure that this pandemic we do not lack what to eat. And the Lord has been doing that. Amen. Amen. All glory go to Him. Hallelujah. For those of you who may not have anything for this week, sufficient on the day, you don't have enough for tomorrow or today. After this service, be honest and wait. But if the Lord has given you today, forget, He will give you the one of tomorrow. Did you hear what I said? Then just shall leave by God has helped people to provide certain little food for some of us. And since yesterday, God has been helping. We've been preaching some of them. Please, please, wait till you know. And if you have enough, and um, you can share with someone, gladly see me. We will shake hands with you. I don't ask us not to shake hands. I'm just shake a holy hand. Amen. Are you still happy? Yes, Ephesians chapter 6. The service. By 11. By thank you, bro. He's doing a good job. Alright, Ephesians chapter 6. How many of you know we're getting used to this thing? It's wonderful. We just have to get into it. Fine to me so that we can continue our testimony. If today is your first day of worship with us, we want to celebrate so that wave your hand wherever you want. Today is your very first day of worship with us. Just wave your hand so that we can celebrate. Come on. Hallelujah. God bless you. 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 Verse number 10. 
just to make sure that I don't know. Amen. You will tell the story. Yeah. And you will be glad that you went through what you went through. Yeah. But let me say something to you. Take this thing like a joke. And be happy. But a joke, I didn't say, don't wash your hand, bro. I didn't say, well, I'm not going to you. I mean, in your attitude, in your heart. Make it light. It's not me. People are going through this now. Before this, it came up. Yes, huh? Yes, Come on, with your hand. I went through it in days ago. No, no, no. I saw that. I have made I told you the story. I have made my trousers so they will put back pockets joy. If your put back, if you see put back pocket joy, it means it was not any out of your size. Mm. Okay. Over many spirit. As though I suspect and suspect it. That's where suit go by. Even the game. Yeah, they will look at polish your shoe. Listen, it's only the man that tells a story that everybody knows where you're coming from. Yeah. So I say, I'm going through a process. I'm going through a process. We have been processed. Some of us will be processed for a better person during this time. Something good will come out of this thing. So don't, don't die, don't break up. There are still better days to come. Better days to come. If you take it light, again, we have blood pressure. So that you can live right to see the better days. Amen. Amen. Ephesians chapter 6. Let's read 10 and 11. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Read verse 11, church. Put on the whole armor of God. Now read it until the person who this starts from you know that you read the Bible. What to go? Put on the whole armor of God, that he may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. Our Father in the heaven, we thank you for your word. Thank you because your word will change life. Thank you because no man that come to your presence leave the self. Let the glory of your presence rub with everybody. Touch us. Challenge us. Build us. In Jesus' precious name we pray. Amen. Before you see that, if you're a child of God, let me hear you shout it loud and amen. Amen. Shout amen unto your enemies are confused. And then you see that thank you. about keeping the faith. Help me look at someone and say, keep the faith. Keep the faith. Help me look at another person and say, keep the faith. Second Timothy chapter 4. Verse 7 told us that I have fought a good fight. God says the Lord asked me to tell you. We've we'll been fighting the stand strong. Stand strong. Be unmovable. Always abounding in the world of truth. So 
Everybody say, I'm unshakable. I'm unshakable. Life will shake men to their foundation. Ladies and gentlemen, you hear me? Life will try you. It doesn't matter where you're coming from. It doesn't matter who can back to you. It doesn't matter what you're made of. But I hear this morning to remind you that life will try you. No matter how life is trying you, I got one word for you. Stand. Yeah. Hey. Hey. When you are so disappointed by your place and you want to imagine what come to, what do you do? Yeah. When those who talk that would have been there for you leave you unattended when they refuse to be your call what did I ask you to do? the Bible says if your faith fails you in the day of adversity then your faith is what? meaning adversity it's a litmus test to prove your faith. Meaning adversity is not unusual. Trouble of life is not strange. It will be with us. It will live with us. It will stay with us. You can't play it out. Oh, I'm praying so that the Lord take away adversity. No. The only thing you can pray that you will be able to what? Stand through. Pass through. Yet though I walk through the valley of shadow of death, I fear no evil. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Come on, look, look at somebody from this time. I say, I come at you this day. Stand strong. I see the salvation of the Lord. Look at another person. Stand strong. The face, some trust in chairs and some trust in the horses. I come to you today in the name that shall come and in the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the Living God. Nothing will seek you, life will not seek you. As a life will not seek you, as a life will not seek you, as a life will not seek you. Against you. It doesn't matter what the plan against you. You will stand strong. I said you will stand strong. I said you will stand strong. It doesn't matter the trials. You will stand strong. Somebody said I will stand strong. Finally, man. This one. We are not going to struggle because we are not going to face what seems to be greater than us. Yeah. Otherwise, if something comes up, you don't tell me to stop the struggle. Okay. Have you seen a man who went to fetch water from their pot and they said the struggle to reach it? No. Because it's no nothing he can handle. It is an unusual thing. That is coming. That was why the advice came and said, Finally, in my advice to you, in these last days, be unmovable. See the ups, see the down, keep the faith. See, right when you need to cry, I'm not saying not to cry, your mama and the chairman. But don't give up. There's a difference between giving up and crying. We need your what I'm saying. Sometimes crying is healthy. 
And Jesus went. If he can win, will be you. Will be a boss. Jesus went. Let it flow. I'm not saying to show my emotions. Release yourself of what trying to talk you. Some of us are choked. You can't talk to anybody. And you want to show your strong. Break down and cry and get up. Be strong. Be strong. Be strong so that you can be able to stand. The difficult times the enemy is about to unleash. The wise of the enemy. He said, for you to listen, put on the whole armor. Not one armor shall be left to succeed in these last days. Keep the faith. Know your value. Be strong. Are you getting where we're going now? Prioritize where you're going. Know your relationship with God. Know that you know that you know that you know that you know that He will never leave you. No what? It doesn't matter how far I have stayed in this dish. What I know that I know that I know that I know that my Redeemer lives. It doesn't matter how long it takes Him to come. One thing I'm sure is that one day my Redeemer shall appear, and when He will appear. Yes, sir. 
be strong. No man has the definition of your destiny. Did you hear what I just said? They can try. They can't define your destiny. Because he hid you in the hollow of his name. It is where men cannot assess. He didn't make you public. It's not public, and that's why you don't know where I'm coming from. You don't know the way that I take. You don't know what I've been through. I've been processed. It's a matter of time. I am not that. It's a matter of time. Those who couldn't see my value. When I'm done. In the form that I should be, who saw me in my raw estate? Ah. Let them wait. What they call trouble is a processing. There's no grip that is on. That will be press. That will say congratulations. No grip that will be press. That will not cry. No grip that is impressed that will not suppress. No grip that is impressed that does not lose its former state. You didn't hear what I said. That the time it was done, it will leave the bush to the big men's. Changing my position. You didn't hear what I'm saying. You didn't hear what I said just now. It may be painful that God is relocating you. It may be painful that God is relocating you. Some trust in chairs, some trust in horses. Until it endure process. If you say it will not be processed, you'll be left to the bush and it will be less value. Come in, say, give the faith. Finally, brother, be strong. I'm in the power. Of his might. Let me talk about his might. Let me drop the mic. His might. Who are we referring to? The Alpha? The who? You discovered him at your beginning as the Alpha. Could you wait to see him as the Omega? Because it is in the Omega that he is glorified. Be a lamb. Oh, let me go close this thing. You didn't hear what I just said. You know him as the Alpha, but you don't know him as the Omega. Can I speak to you? When he become Omega to you, his common here is not his common here. So you don't use your experience to define him in me. Hey! On the way, on the way, on the way. That's a part of me you don't see. 
What you're seeing is in the beginning. You have not seen my end. Number two. God is with me. God is with me. Have I not said this to you? For I know the thought I have towards you. It is not of good and not of evil to bring you. To bring me, stick your hand up to the expected end. Deep means definite. Deep, not a. Setting. So, you need to start from knowing you are not going through this alone. Somebody shout, I'm not going through this alone. I'm not going through this alone. This one thing I know, Kingsley know, that no matter how bad, is closer than a friend. It's closer than a brother. It's closer than a parent. Is closer than the spouse, no matter how bad it is. That's when things get bad, certain people can't touch you. You didn't hear what I said. There are times of life where certain people in life who have vowed never to leave you will say, Anyway, at this point, I tried. They will give up on you. He said, I will take you to the expected end. Meaning, it doesn't matter at all. The rubbish that will rob you. I remember when the word of Baba told me, Son, no man leaves a cow without matching the sheet of a cow. So now, as you're leaving the cow, you'll be stained. Yes, he is not ashamed of me. Why should that's not about He is not ashamed of me. I will never leave you nor forsake you. Meaning it doesn't matter how the world view you. I'll be there. I'll be there. I will never leave you nor forsake you. That's a certain deep word of promise. Not a man to man. It is God to man. What a privilege. Oh, don't take me to my teaching mood. I will never leave you means even when all, all left you. I'll be right there. But all I need you to do is stand strong and look that up close. Stand strong so that you can hear me when I speak. Stand strong so that you can be led by man and by son. I started with you, I'm the Alpha. I will also be the Omega. There is nothing he started that he doesn't finish. It's not a part of our man, no project. Can I get you to stand on your feet, everybody? I feel something big. I feel something. There's a glory coming upon this church this morning. There's a glory coming upon this church this morning. There's a glory coming. Do you need it? Do you want it? Come on now, lift your hands and cry to it. Hello! Let the glory go stand strong. Come upon me. Now listen. I have five minutes. Do you know that it's a spirit that makes you to stand strong? Or not to stand strong? If the spirit of Christ, if the spirit of that God that raised Christ from the dead, dwells in you in the spirit dwells in you it will weaken your mortal body because you are identity with your mortal body your mortal body says no your mortal body says I'm tired your mortal body says I can't continue your mortal body says I can't go on far your mortal body wants to give up relationship your mortal body says this is too much but the spirit says guess you are falling I go inside of life Dreams and visions shadow You are broken inside 
Things are different now. Something happened. For the law of sin and death can hold them. Listen to me. They are defiling the law of this world. It is law that introduces sin. Without law, there's no sin. He said the law of sin and death and the power to hold a man have no nothing. Let me hear your shout, the shout you're about to shout. 